Thank you for joining us today. Would you like to introduce yourselves and tell us what you do? Okay, my name's uh, Toriyama and I'm uh, the director on Lightning Returns Final Fantasy XIII. Lightning Returns Final Fantasy XIII, game design director on Okay, uh, my name's Yuji Abe and I'm the game design director on Lightning Returns Final Fantasy XIII. Pleasure to meet you both. Why do you think this? Would you like to tell us about Final Fantasy XIII? Lightning Returns Final Fantasy XIII. Do you mean the whole series or just the game? Actually, Lightning Returns. Lightning Returns is just a bit of a problem. <laughs> Tell us the entire story of Final Fantasy. I'm very excited. Simple, simple, simple. 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 Simple, あのいつも主人公になっていたんですけれどもライトニングというのは初めてシリーズで初めて女性のキャラクターを主人公にし、えー、なった作品が「まあ、ファイナルファンタジー13」ですでライトニングはですねあの一作目の時にあの妹のセラを救うために、えー、神様の使いとなって、えー、戦うことになったんですけれども今作、えー、もうその時から千年ぐらいの,あの時を経てあのもう一度よみがえって Okay, um, the Final Fantasy series uh, up until now has generally been known that it's always had a male protagonist as the main characters, and uh, Lightning is the first uh, full female lead role in any Final Fantasy game. Uh, the first game, obviously, the original Final Fantasy XIII.、Uh, and in the original title, she was、um, on a mission to save the, the life of her younger sister, Sarah,、uh, and she became the agent of、uh, a certain deity in the mythology of the universe there、uh, in order to. Fight to go out and fight to save her sister.、Um, but this time round, in the third, se- third game in the series, in Lightning Returns, Lightning obviously has returned, and、uh, this is now set a thousand years after the events of the first and second、uh, games. And she returns again this time、uh, in a mission to find out what happened to her sister and also to、uh, save the world,、uh, which is now facing imminent destruction.、Uh, so you've developed、uh, a new gameplay system for Lightning Returns. Would you like to tell us a little bit about that? あのこのライディングリターンズは全く新しいゲームプレイのシステムと仕組みをあの作っているとお聞きしたんですが、そういう新しいシステムについて説明をお願いします。はい、えー、と本作はですね、えー、とワールドドリブンというコンセプトがありまして、えー、プレイヤーの周りが、えー、リアルタイムに動いていく中、ユーザーがその中で、えー、自由な選択をしながらゲームを攻略するというスタイルがまず一つ。で、あとはですね、えー、と旧2作から大きく変わったのが、えー、バトルのシステムで、旧2作では、えーパー,ティーのバトルを使っていたあーパーティーバトルを行っていたんですけど、この作では、えー、ライフニング1人のキャラクターで、えー、とバトルを行います。でこの操作は、えーとですね、アクションゲームのようにダイレクトに操作ができるようになったので、えー今えー、戦略性とかです、ね、選択性というのはそのままに、えー、今まで通りの,その戦略性の高いバトルを、えー、行うことができます。OK、um...。The main、uh, philosophy that we had when designing the new game,、uh, the concept which goes behind all of the design decisions, really, is to make it very much a world driven kind of game.、Uh, the idea there being that obviously the world that the, the game takes place in and the player inhabits actually moves and changes and shifts、uh, while the player is not looking,、uh, and they, it's a living world in a lot of ways. And obviously, the, the freedom that this gives is to give the player free choices about everything that they can do in the game. They can do what they want, when they want, anytime. That, that's the, the main design, the overall design decision. I think of all the systems in the new game, obviously the battle system、uh, is perhaps the newest and the most,、uh, the most big, biggest move away from what, what's happened in the previous titles.、Uh, obviously, in the, in the previous games in the series, you had very much、uh, a very tactical battle system, which is based around three characters, and you use the paradigm shift system where you change the roles of those characters around.、Uh, this time, obviously, we've changed it so that you've just got lightning, you've only got one character 
under your control. But there's still a lot of tactical options uh, and changing around and different strategic things you can do. But the overall way that the actions are implemented and the choices you make is very directly controlled by the player, uh, as opposed to the indirect system previously. So you can still change and, uh, and alter what the character does and all the parameters around them, but the way you carry out your actions is very direct and pretty straightforward now. Um, you can also customise your weapons and also Lightning's outfits. So do you want to talk a bit about that? Now, I'm going on to customise yours, but can I all go out and keep on this game? そういうカスタマイズシステムについてお願いします。はい、えー、本作のカスタマイズですね。えっ、ー、とまずそのウェアを中心としたえっ、ー、とスタイルと呼んでいるものなんですけれども、えっ、ー、とですね、えーと、使用するアビリティとですね、えー、あとはその変化するパラメータというものがそのウェアに紐づいていて、それにさらにえっ、ー、と攻撃力と防御力を持つ武器と盾というもので自由にカスタマイズします。さらにここにえっ、ー、とウェアごとにえっ、ー、と設定できるアビリティというものが決まっているので、こう自由にセーフトすることによって、えー、えー、9作9、2作でいうそのロールのようなロールをコントロールするような感じで、えー、その自分のえっ、ー、とバトルタスクというものを作ることができるようになっています。Okay,、uh, in, the, in the new battle system, you can customize the outfit, the clothing that Lightning wears from a huge number of different outfits, and you've also got the weapons and accessories and armor and stuff. You can change together.、Um, and the way that this links into the battle system, it's, it's very closely tied to the battle system, really, because every time you change outfits, it gives you、uh, the character different、uh, skills, abilities, and parameters. So there's some abilities which are linked to certain outfits,、um, others will increase some characteristics and lower others, maybe.、Uh, and there's also separate set of abilities you can choose what, you, what your attacks or maneuvers you use in battle, and you can set different ones into different costumes there. So that's all. Very much what, what the, as well as the, the visual aspect, that's very much what the customized system is about, too.、Uh, and obviously, as in all other previous games, it also changes the actual the, the attacking power, defensive power, various depending on the weapon you've got equipped.、Um, basically, the idea of the different、um, outfits you can switch between is,、uh, is a mirror of what we had with the roles that you played, the, the different characters played in the previous game. So, by setting a little customized set like this equipment here with these abilities and these attacks and these powers. You can use that as a certain role or a certain strategic、um, base that you want to use in battle and then switch between those depending on the situation. So, the customization is very much to do with strategic battle system, too. Excellent. The game is very atmospheric. There's a lot of、uh, music that really draws you into the story. Do you want to talk a bit about the music?、えー強いあの印象をつける雰囲気があるんですけども、その中で特に音楽があのかなり大きな役目をあの担っていると思います。その音楽のあの制作選択についてちょっと説明してもらます。はい。あのー、まあ今作の音楽の特徴はですね、あのー、まあバルドドリブンというコンセプトが24時間の時間をえこう世界の動きの中をしっかり描くというのをコンセプトにしているんですけども、音楽も同じような形で朝昼晩、えー、もしくは夕方みたいなあの時間の推移を一つの、えー、大陸の中で、えー、曲音楽を使ってでも音楽を使いながら、えー、それを表現しています。Yeah, I'd like I just mentioned previously the,、uh, the world-driven nature of the game is one of the main pillars of, of the design and the concept behind it, and we really wanted the music to be part of that and reflect. The changing of the world, in fact, it moves and alters without the player's、uh, direct input. So, in that same respect, too, we've got, for example, the music will change depending on the time of day. So, if you're on the same area of the game, same continent, same town, then there's a different music or a different style of music for the morning, for the midday, then for afternoon, and sometimes for evening as well. So, I really wanted to put the same concept behind there, that the world's constantly changing and moving, and the, the atmospheric music there is one tool we've got to do that. Excellent. What's been the single biggest challenge for you guys on this particular game? The ま、今回の開発にあたってあの一番チャレンジ、一番難しいものとは何だったんでしょうか。ああ、そうですね。その今回の中ではその短期短期間の中でゲームのシステム自体を大きく変えるというのは非常にえっとチャレンジだったと思
を、えー、と1作目2作目の経験があった上でなんですけれども、えー、と短期の中で作り上げたというのはチャレンジだったと思います。Um, yeah, I think... Probably what we think the biggest challenge we have is the fact that the development cycle of this game was actually rather short.、Uh, and certainly to be able to make such massive changes to what we've done before in the series in such a short time, that, that was quite a bit of a challenge. I think the overall development time was about a year and a half that we had.、Uh, and our mission and、uh, what we wanted to achieve and what we actually had to do was basically to create what was essentially a completely new game from the ground up because we don't really reuse any of the assets from the previous games here.、Um, obviously, the map, the world map in the game is completely new. Got an entirely new battle system as well.、Uh, and then, just as mentioned in, in the answer to the previous question, we've got all the locations and all the game areas have to change and shift over this 24 hour time. So, getting that cycle in place with only a year and a half of development to get such an amount of stuff in there, that was, that was quite tough. And obviously, we had to really make sure that the engine was suitable for that too and adjust that.、Uh, but I think with the experience that we gained on working on the previous two games in the series,、uh, that actually made it a lot easier and helped us to overcome that difficulty. Well, it certainly looks very good. いやでも本当にあの素晴らしい見た目なんですよ。感動しました。For those who haven't played the previous titles,、um, is this game going to be harder for them, or can they jump in on this third and final? But how do you hard to understand it? Into yeah, in terms of the story. え、そうですね。あの今までサーティンシリーズのどの作品もやったことない方にとってはあのこの入りにくいっていうかあの理解しにくいっていうところありますか。それともすぐにあの楽しめますか。はい、あの今作は世界や、えー、キャラクターは確かにあのサーティンシリーズの、えー、ものなんですけれどもあの新たにあの残り13日世界の終わりまでと残り13日で新しい世界を、えー、作っていますでそこに、えー、ライトニングが目覚めたのは本当に数日前ぐらいの話なのでライトニングがこの世界を知るのと同じような形でプレイヤーを初めてのプレイヤーも、えー、世界やストーリーを、えー Um, yeah, I mean, clearly, it is set in the same universe, the same world as the previous two Final Fantasy XIII games. But this time around, obviously, the whole what, the, the idea behind the story and where it starts is with the world sort of being destroyed and remade,、uh, and it's set a thousand years later on. So it's a very different world to what we've got previously. And the world is now 13 days before the apocalypse, before it gets destroyed and everything ends. Uh, and then into this, basically, the time the story starts when you start adventuring with Lightning, she's only really awoken from her long slumber a few days before this. So, to her, it's a completely new world, and she doesn't really doesn't know what, what's there, and she has to explore it and find out what's going on.、Uh, and that's very much the same position that a completely new player would be in. So, in that case, you'll be experiencing the world and learning about it at the same pace as Lightning. So, in that way, we think that it's very good for a new player to get into as well. Excellent. Uh, and final question,、um, what is next for you guys once this game ships? Other than possibly a vacation. Uh, yeah, no, I mean, obviously, we've、uh, been working on the 13 series for a very long time,、uh, and there's been a lot of support from, from the fans and players, that was great, so、uh, it was good to work on that. But yeah, I think I will take a bit of a break and then see what comes next after that. Thank you very much for your time today.